Hello everyone, welcome to the Mathematics in my channel. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting integral. Integral from minus pi over 2 to pi over 2 cosine of x over 1 plus cosine of x raised to the tan of x. Okay, what do you think? How to start? Um, if you think uh, thoroughly, we know here in the numerator, uh, we have uh, cosine of x, cosine of x we know. Uh, even function and here also we have even function uh, tan of x we know odd function so i am going to uh, more generalize this integral so i am going to define functions uh, e1 of x and e1 of x and e2 of x uh, uh, these are even functions even functions and I'm going to take uh, O of x, O of x, uh, odd function, O of x, odd function. So I'm going to generalize uh, the integral. So I'm going to take I is equal to, I is equal to uh, minus A to A, minus A to A. Uh, instead of uh, cosine of x, I am going to take uh, here even function. So in the numerator, I am going to take even function uh, e1 of x, e1 of x over here uh, 1 plus. Uh, again, uh, here we have uh, even function. So I am going to take e2 of x, e2 of x uh, here uh, raised to the tan of x, we know odd function. So here raised to the o of x we know o of x is equal to uh, odd function so here dx okay then uh, now we are going to evaluate uh, this integral as a first step i am going to take a substitution uh, x is equal to uh, minus u so we should differentiate dx is equal to minus du uh, and uh, also we should uh, change the uh, lower limit and upper limit we know uh, lower limit when x approaches to minus a uh, u approaches to a and upper limit uh, when x approaches to a we know uh, u approaches to minus a then we can plug in uh, to our integral so now uh, limit uh, we know a to minus a uh, here e1 of e1 of uh, here e uh, capital e not a special function uh, i introduced this fun functions uh, in uh, as a even function so e1 of uh, x we know minus u so minus u over 1 plus e2 of instead of x now minus u uh, raised to the raised to the o of minus u and dx we know here dx minus d u so here minus d u okay then um, we know uh, here a to minus a uh, we can uh, interchange uh, this boundary uh, to minus a to a when we change the boundary we know this minus sign get uh, cancelled so we have uh, here uh, e1 of minus u so now the integral variable is u but we know the definite integral independent of the variable uh, we have this identity minus a to a f of x dx is equal to minus a to a uh, f of u d u so we can apply this property so we can write here e1 of minus x over 1 plus e2 of minus x raised to the o of minus x dx okay then uh, we know about even function and odd function uh, if we have even function uh, f of minus x we know this is equal to f of x uh, then uh, if we have odd function we know f of minus x is equal to minus f of x so now we can uh, write our integral is equal to minus a to a e1 of minus x we know e1 uh, is a even function 
so uh, e1 of minus x is equal to e1 of x e1 of x over 1 plus here also we have e2 of x raised to the now here we have uh, odd function o of minus x so we know minus o of x dx okay then um, now we can simplify the denominator uh, like integral from minus a to a e1 of x over 1 plus now uh, here power we have minus sign so we can write here uh, 1 over e2 of x raised to the e2 of x raised to the o of x dx now we can take common denominator and uh, simplify minus a to a in the numerator we have e1 of x uh, here e2 of x raised to the o x we know uh, we should write in the numerator again so e2 of uh, x raised to the o of x over uh, here uh, 1 times e2 of x raised to the o x so here plus 1 again we have 1 plus e2 of x uh, to the o of x dx okay we know uh, this integral also equal to i uh, then uh, our first integral here uh, i uh, now here we have our last integral so i am going to take sum of our first integral and last integral so we can write 2 times i 2 times 2 times i is equal to limit uh, minus a to a now we know the denominators are same so uh, denominators are same so we have 1 plus e2 of x raised to the o of x and uh, here uh, denominator uh, and here we know e1 of x uh, we can take uh, as a uh, common factor so we have e1 of x times 1 plus e2 of x e2 of x raised to the uh, o of x dx now we know uh, this part get cancelled so we have i is equal to one half minus a to a e1 of x dx okay now uh, we can uh, easily evaluate our integral uh, now we know j is equal to one half uh, instead of minus a lower limit we know minus phi over 2 upper limit pi over 2 e1 of x we know uh, our first even function e1 of x cosine of x here so we have here cosine of x dx now one half uh, we know the integration of cosine of x is equal to uh, sine of x uh, limit from minus phi over 2 to phi over 2 then if we apply limit uh, we know sine of phi over 2 1 minus minus sine of phi over 2 so plus 1 so 1 plus 1 2 2 get cancelled and we have 1 okay this is the answer for this integral if you like this type of uh, videos please subscribe this channel thank you for watching